Hi everyone, my name is Judy. I'm with Empower Simcoe Early On Child and Family Center here in Barrie. Today I thought I would share a story with you that's a fairy tale or a fable. And so it's been told all around the world in many different languages and in many different ways. And today I'm going to share it with you using puppets. And I wonder if you can guess what the story is called. It's about pigs and there are one, two, three pigs in this story. Can you guess what the story is called? It's called The Three Little Pigs. So I'm going to introduce you to the characters in the story. So I'll start off with this first little pig. Hello! And what do you have in your hand there? It looks like straw. Is that what it is? Straw? Did you find that on your farm? Yeah. The three little pigs live on a farm with their mummy and their daddy and their grandma. And straw, that's what's left over when the farmers grow the grains for our cereal and for our bread that we eat. And lots of animals on the farm like to eat straw. The next little pig, hmm, looks like this little pig's carrying something in his hand too. Hi! This little pig is carrying some sticks. Oh, did you find those at the farm too? Mm -hmm. Did they come off the tree? Yeah, sticks come from the trees. The last little pig, oh boy. This little pig is carrying something too, and it looks really heavy. Is that a heavy thing you're carrying? Mm hmm. And look, can I take a look? It looks like a brick. Oh boy, yes, bricks are heavy. They're made out of clay from the earth, and they're fired in a big, big oven to make them hard. And they're used for building things like houses and buildings. Those are the three little pigs. Okay, we can get started on our story now that we have all the characters oh. introduced. What? Who is that? Oh, oh, I almost forgot. I didn't introduce you to the star of the show. And that is the big bad wolf. He doesn't look very bad, does he? No. Hi, big bad wolf. Big Bad Wolf would like to share a sound with us. Do you know what wolves say? Can you help us? They go like this. <gasps> Big breath. <gasps> <laughs> that was fun. Would you like to do it again? Yeah? Okay, let's make that sound again. Big breath in. <gasps> that was fun. Okay, let's get started with our story, The Three Little Pigs. So the three little pigs lived on a farm with their mom and with their dad and their grandma. And they grew bigger and they grew bigger and they grew bigger until they were grown up pigs. And then they decided it was time for them to move out and build their own houses. So the first little pig, he decided, well, I don't want to take a long time building my house. I want to have lots of fun and play. So I'm going to build my house out of straw and that won't take me very long at all. So he built his house out of straw and it only took him half a day. Do you want to see a picture? That's a great house. I like that house made out of straw. The next little pig, he decided, I think I'm going to build my house out of sticks. And it took him a whole day to build his house out of sticks. And he worked very hard. Would you like to see a picture too? That's a great house. I like that house. Then, the last little pig, 
He liked to take his time, and he liked to work slowly at things. He was very methodical, and he said, I'm going to build my house out of bricks, and I'm going to use bricks and mortar. That's what makes the bricks stick to the other bricks. And it's going to take me a while, but when it's finished, it's going to be a good, sturdy house. So he worked and he worked and he worked. And it took him more than one day, more than two days. It took him three days to build his house. But when it was finished, it was a good, strong brick house with a chimney. Would you like to see a picture? That's a great house. So the pigs moved out into their own houses and they were very happy in their houses. And then one day, you guessed it, a big bad wolf came along and he said, hey, where are those three little pigs that I like to chase after all the time? I checked with their mom and dad and they moved out of the farm and they didn't even tell me. I'm going to go look for their new houses. So away he went looking for their new houses. And the first house he came to, do you remember what it was made out of? That's right, it was made out of straw. And the big bad wolf said, Little pig, little pig, let me come in. And the little pig said, No, not by the hair of my chinny chin chin. I will not let you in. Well, then I'll huff and I'll puff and I'll blow your house in. So he huffed. Can you help? Take a deep breath in. And he puffed. And he blew down the little pig's house. Oh, no. And the little pig ran all the way to his brother's house. Do you remember what the second pig's house was made out of? Something that comes from the trees. Do you remember? That's right. It was sticks. And so the two little pigs were together in the house made out of sticks. And along came, you guessed it, the big bad wolf. And he said... Little pigs, little pigs, let me come in. And they said, no, not by the hair of our chinny chin chins. We will not let you in. And so the wolf said, then I'm going to huff, I'm going to puff, and I'm going to blow your house in. <gasps> so he huffed, can you help? And he puffed, <sighs> but he didn't blow the house in. So he tried a little harder. Take a deep, deep breath. <sighs> and he blew the house right down. <gasps> oh no, said the little pigs. And they ran all the way to the other brother's house. Do you remember what the other brother was living in? What was his house made out of? That's right. It was made out of bricks. And the three little pigs were all huddled in the house made out of bricks when along came the big bad wolf. And he said, little pigs, little pigs, let me come in. And they said, no, no, not by the hair of our chinny chin chins. We won't let you in. And I'm going to huff, I'm going to puff, and I'm going to blow your house in. So he huffed. And he puffed and he couldn't blow the house down. So he tried again, deep breath. And he still couldn't blow the house in. So he tried one more time. Oh my goodness, take a deep breath. And he still couldn't blow the house down. It was a very sturdy brick house. And the pig said, na 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 da boo boo you can't blow the house still, na 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 da boo boo Well, said the big bad wolf, I'm going to come down your chimney. But the pigs had lit a fire in their far place that day because it was a little chilly. And when the big bad wolf got to the chimney, 
there was lots of smoke coming out. And he said, whoa, that doesn't look safe at all. I gotta run back home. Hey, pigs. Come out and play next time, okay? I want to chase you. Okay, said the three little pigs. And then the three little pigs lived happily with their brother in his brick house until they went and built their own brick houses and they lived happily and safely ever after. I hope you had fun today. I'll see you next time. Bye for now. Mm -hmm.